News Rescue Our attention has been drawn to statements credited to the Senate Committee on Power, Steel Development and Metallurgy Thursday, December 14, 2017, disparaging the Ergesig Education Program, EEP, of the Rural Electrification Agency, RIA, in conjunction with the Ministry of Power Works and Housing which is aimed at providing uninterrupted power supply to the nation's federal universities and seven university teaching hospitals. The Senate committee had described the project as mere street lighting project during the budget defense of the RIA. We find this very laughable because the brief of the EEP as expatiated by the RIA managing director during the budget session had stated otherwise. We condemn, in the strongest terms the attempt by these self-serving lawmakers to derail a project that will bring succor to students and enhance learning by bringing epileptic power supply to an end in our citadels of learning. The first phase of the project which was factored into the 2018 budget will benefit nine universities and one university teaching hospital spread across the six geopolitical zones. It is therefore inconceivable that the people's representatives are attempting to obstruct the project based on frivolous arguments. The committee had questioned the rationale behind projects citing the privatization of power forgetting that states like Lagos are already generating and distributing off-grid captive power that has been providing uninterrupted power supply to state institutions, general hospitals amongst others. It also questioned the Locus study of the RIA to implement the project turning a blind eye to the fact that most of the universities are in rural areas and adjoining communities will also enjoy uninterrupted power supply on completion of the program. Based on these facts, we commend the Bahari administration for thinking out of the box to address the perennial power shortages that has adversely affected academic activities in our varsities. We express our unalloyed support for the Education Ergesig program, EEP, and we put the Senate Committee and indeed the National Assembly on notice that we will resist any attempt to obstruct or derail the implementation of this laudable project in the 2018 fiscal year. As representatives of students in the country, we are ready to use every legal means at our disposal to ensure that the EEP scales through at the National Assembly. Any representative that stands in the way of it will be treated as a to people. We earnestly hope that sane reasoning prevails. Amalgam of Federal University's Student Unions Signed, 1 Abdulazit Okoye, Student Union President, University of Abuja 2 Olaseidadi Ika, Student Union President, Federal University of Technology, Akure 3 Adibisai Ridwa, Student Union President, University of Ilarai 4. Abdullah He is male, Student Union President, Federal University. Saima Katsia State. 5. E. Jike Confidence SUG President. University of Egeria Yugu Campus UNN, UK.